The local economy taking a hit. The malls and many stores and restaurants now closed. On top of hurting employees, no sales tax means that's going to hurt city budgets. Here's Channel 5's Christian Colon. It's quiet in downtown McAllen. Not many cars, people, and no money. Nothing like this in modern history that we can compare it to. To have this widespread of a slowdown or shutdown is pretty dramatic. And the numbers we saw in the survey were really bearing that out. From nail salons, barber shops to food establishments, the McAllen Chamber of Commerce questioned more than 200 businesses in the city regarding COVID-19. What they found was more than 80% suffered an economic injury and 60% of them reduced operations. Alenia says it's a combination of stay-at-home orders plus the fact that most businesses are considered non-essential, not to mention the drop of visitors to the region. Come down and either sell, service, or work, or do things with the tequila industry in Reynosa. Once the once the uh, ports of entries were closed, once they had travel restrictions of going in, that that travel stopped, and so that was a major part of business for the hotels. The reduced access to clients and customers was their number one reason for the loss of money. The second reason was due to the uncertainty business owners are living in. Others include not being able to get critical supplies. It's time for us as a community to step up and help support our local businesses. And there are ways that you can do that. So obviously with our restaurants, ordering out, doing curbside service with them is one. In terms of employees, data shows more than 100,000 people have been furloughed, laid off, or have seen a reduction in hours. Second, we're working with our businesses that are selling online right now. Uh, and we're going to be promoting those businesses that are selling online and encouraging people to buy something from them. And only about 34% of the nearly 200 owners tested are selling online. Another reason the chamber encourages those who are still earning money to spend it and help small businesses because no spending is also hurting the economy. In McAllen, Christian Colon, Channel 5 News at 10.